Hi there, let's talk about what I did in October. <laughs> so um, I am showing you what my front room looks like. This is where we have our dining room table and we have a little um, bench back there, a church pew type thing. Um, I really wanted that. And these are the pumpkins that we carved yesterday for Halloween. So this has been recorded on November 1st. And um, so this one here is the um, Mario, Super Mario, um, like a cube or whatever. All the kids in the neighborhood absolutely loved this pumpkin. This is my husband's pumpkin. This one is my pumpkin. I, I like it. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> so anyway, I just wanted to share that with you guys. Um, let's go ahead and see what I did in October. Um, in la in September, I was you know behind in everything, and I got caught up with the things that I did in August and September all at once. This is like the first time I've been like on time. So let's just do this. <laughs> uh, let's find the right buttons and get my screen shared. Okay, I don't have my browser up. Here we go. Okay, let's see if I can make me a little bigger. Ooh, nice. So here I am with my reading challenge. I am five books ahead of schedule, which is pretty good. Um, I set my goal for 50. That's pretty much been my cap so far. The one time I tried to go to 75 might have been when COVID hit and that just went horribly. <laughs> so if I decide to increase next year, it'll be to like maybe 60. Um, but I think 50 is my comfort zone. Um, so I'm, like I said, I'm five books ahead of schedule. I am going to be dedicating December mostly to reading picture books, but I'll also read whatever my IWSG book club books are. And I'm going to talk about that in a minute. So let's look at what I'm currently reading. I haven't been doing that a lot, but this one I'm probably gonna finish tonight. And I felt like so bad that I didn't get it in for my October um, read, but that's okay. So this is what I am currently reading. It's loading, loading, loading. <laughs> All right, let's scroll. Okay, scroll this page. It's a lot going on here. I am reading um, the Book of the Dead. Um, what does it say? A Spooky Fun Witch Adventure, Spell Light, number one. This is actually a spinoff of the Ghost Writers series. So the, um, this author, I love her. Um, I'm not a big horror person, but she writes good dark fantasy and um, also horror. Then pretty much she's the only horror that I read. <laughs> <laughs> but this is not horror. Um, the Ghost Riders series is, um, it gets very, it very much crosses over to that horror, um, very dark paranormal type stuff. Um, and this one is a spinoff of that where it's focusing on one of the side characters from that series. Um, this is about Laura the Witch and I'm very much enjoying it. And um, I'll be giving my review very shortly. Uh, well, I have to finish it first. <laughs> but anyway, so let's get into what I actually read in October. I read three books in October. Loading, 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 loading. All right, so I'm going to let this page load before I start trying to scroll because when I did that before, some stuff happened. <laughs> um, okay, so I think it's done loading. And now I'm going to scroll. Okay. So this is Voice of the Just, the Blue Sapphire Story, True Colors, number three. So um, I started this series during um, the, the, the initial like lockdown for the whole pandemic thing. And um, I just finished book two. Um, I just finished book three. And uh, I think I already have book four. I just have to find it. It's somewhere on my Kindle. Um, and so I enjoyed it. I gave it four stars and I'll be giving my review on that shortly. The next two books that I read in October were books for the IWSG book club. Um, no, 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 that's not true. What did I read for the, oh, I know, <laughs> my bad. This, act, this book is actually written by someone who is a member of the IWSG, but this was not our book club read. Um, in, in any case, um, 
I met this author through the IWS. She read the first book, loved it. So I was very excited to read this book. And as you can see, I gave it five stars. Um, the IWSG book club books were Dragon of the Stars, which I think I've talked about that before because I read it a long time ago. I've read it several times and reviewed it. Um, but the next book was the other IWSG book club book, and that is Already Home. And so this one is a move my little thing here, McGuire's Corner novel. This is a I, I was told that it was a contemporary romance, but in reading it, it's actually a romantic suspense, which is all good for me. And so I ended up giving an overall um, four star rating on that. I'll get more into it in my review. The actual rating that I'm going to say for this one is a 3.75. I'm very much interested in reading more books in this series, and my review will explain why it's a 3.75. Anyway, that is what I actually read in October. Let me close some of this down let's see here try to get back to <laughs> something okay so I'm on time for the month of October I just who can't believe it <laughs> I'm hoping to get this wrap up soon I'm going to record my review video and see what I can get done I know that the IWSG book club books for the month of November are short books which I'm kind of excited about um, just because it means I'll be able to get more stuff in before I get to my um, December reading of the picture books. And so, yeah, that's what I read. Um, please let me know what you read. Stick around for the book review video if you want some longer content and be safe out there, guys. Bye.